Hi, my name is Jing Yi, and my group members are Jun Xian, Jie Yan, Tang Yi, and Xin Yi. Now I'm going to introduce about the company. The Turin Loving Company was founded on 11 July 2006 by Julia Chung and Kao Chai Ti. It was the first Malaysian social enterprise that produced and sold household cleaning products to the public. The company's mission is to help the charities by becoming the preferred brand among the conscientious customers. The first CSR initiative the firm has done is Bought for Good Activity, which is an activity you challenge somebody you know to become a bot in exchange for a charity donation to Hospice Malaysia due to their insufficient funds. And this activity can be linked by the cash model to philanthropic responsibility as the charity donation has successfully raised an amount of 42,150 ringgit Malaysia to purchase a medical equipment to them. And by providing the wide range of new medical equipment, the Hospice Malaysia is now a better place to deliver a better quality of care to their patients. Moving on to the next CSR initiative, the Truly Loving Company has partnered up with Free Tree Society to organize a green campaign which they assist people in the workshop for planting purposes such as the water procedures and the process of composting to encourage people to care more about the environment. The Carol's models that link to this CSR initiative is ethical responsibilities. With this campaign, the company has successfully donated 50,000 ringgit Malaysia to Free Tree Society to assist their purposes in helping the local communities. With the donation, Free Tree Society is able to plant more fruit trees at their charity's partner places. It helps to contribute to a better sustainable environment and educate the future generation to have more awareness of the green places around them. Then another CSI initiative is by having a transparent workforce culture. It is to show that the truly loving company is trustworthy and reliable by providing a clear financial report to the stakeholders. Thus, it shows that the truly loving company has been practicing legal responsibility which shares their report to stakeholders to get to know the overall performance of the firm and also ensure employees' rights by having fair wages, working conditions and providing training for employees. Now I'll be talking about three recommendations. Firstly, the truly loving company can provide an information of employee satisfaction of the overall firm through website to ensure a better transparent internal workforce. Second, the company also can promote socially and environmentally beneficial activities to encourage young people to participate. Lastly, the company also can organize more activities to discover talents and interests instead of donating to their philanthropic partners. Thank you.